How are you doing today? This is Vincent again from NewbieWebDesign.com and this is a tutorial on how to create a link with Web Page Maker Overview Part 4 Hyperlinks. Now a hyperlink can be a word or a group of words or an image that you click on and it takes you to another page within your website or to another web page in a completely different website. Every web page on your website or every web page on another website has a unique address called a URL or Uniform Resources Locator. Now I already have my web page maker editor open and I've typed in some text and I put in a small image and a large image. Now in order to create a link you need to highlight or select an image or some text. Let's go ahead and select go to my web page, click on the hyperlink button, and here is my link editor or hyperlink editor, and it's made up of five sections. The link type, the URL, the bookmark, the target, and the title. The link type is where you use the box to select the type of hyperlink you want to create. As an example, by default, you can create a link to a web page on the site that you are making. Or, you can click another website and type in or paste an address to another website. You can create a link to one of your emails. So right after mail to, you just type in your email. Uh, create a link to an FTP address or create a link to a file on your computer. So what you would do is click browse, look through your computer. As an example, maybe you have a ebook in a PDF file format. You can find that, upload it to your website. People could look at it online or they could download it. Okay. Let's go back to a page on my website in the URL box. This here would show us all the web pages I have on this website. And I could cl click on page 1, page 2, page 3, page 4, or page 5, and whatever page I clicked on, that is where my link would go. Okay. Now another way to get to your link editor is by right clicking on text or an image. Let's right click on this small image here. Go down to link to, click on that, and now we're back to our editor. And here I have it linked to another website. Again, I could type in or paste the address. Here I can give it a title like web design and this would tell them what they can expect on the other side of the link. I hit OK and let's go ahead and preview. Okay, when I hover over this image it says web design so they know that's what they're going to see on the other side of this link and if I click on this image it's going to take me to my web page. Okay, so there we go. We're at on another web page. Very easy to create links. Okay, let's go ahead and right click on the large image, go to link to and target. Target makes it so your web page can open different ways in different browsers. Now I'm limited on time and you can read the web page maker PDF tutorial and learn all about targeted links. So the next thing that I want to talk about is bookmarks and how to create a hyperlink to a bookmark. Create hyperlinks with bookmarks. Now a bookmark is an invisible marker that can be placed anywhere on a web page and when you click on an image or text you'll be taken to that part of the web page. As an example, you may be at a website 
and it's very long and you scroll down or read down to the very bottom and at the bottom it says back to top so a lot of web pages will have an image or a text that says back to top so all you got to do is click on that and it will just jump you right to the top of that page saving you a lot of time so if you create a long page always put a bookmark so people can go back to the top or they could go to the bottom or to the middle of a page. Okay, let's go ahead and create a hyperlink with a bookmark on the same page. Okay, I'm going to go to insert and bookmark and there's my little marker which is invisible to when people see your web page online and I want to move that up here to the top of the page I can also double click on that and this is bookmark one or I can rename it and make sure if you rename it there's no spaces in between the letters and I would hit OK. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to scroll down here select back to the top click on the hyperlink button and this is page one bookmark one a page on my site I'm gonna hit OK as an example I could have made it to page this is page one bookmark one hit OK let's preview that and let's go on down here to the bottom back to top and now I'm at the top of the page just like that very simple to do Okay, let's create a bookmark and a link to that bookmark on a different page from the one we're on. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and click on F8 on my keyboard. That opens up my site contents. I'm going to go to page 2. And I'm going to go to insert a bookmark. And I'm going to go ahead and scroll down here by these triangles which is somewhere on the center of my page and now I'm going to go to back to page one and I'm going to go and select here hit the hot button and link page on my site to page 2 to bookmark 1 and I'm going to hit OK I'm going to go ahead and preview this click here takes me to my second page to where my triangles are so I jumped to that part of the page so pretty simple to do too so uh, you can save people a lot of time by letting them jump to certain areas of your website or to another page okay let's create one more link what we're going to do is double click on this text here and we're going to select or highlight the text go to my web page now you're going to see this change right here so let's go ahead and highlight that now I can add a link here and we can make it to another page on my website or another website so let's go ahead and paste that in there and let's call it uh, again web uh, design we can call it whatever we want uh, we could uh, hit OK and let's preview this click on this and it'll take me to my home page that's just a way to create a link to text okay I hope that helped you there's a, a little bit more to creating links but again I'm limited on time and I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and, and uh, thank you for watching